I've got my eye on you. And them over there too. I don't miss a thing. Really? My son. He's only a boy. See here. Lynn's the journalist. I thought we'd be safe in the gate. Oh god, journalists. They are usually bad news. Well, all you want. Ah, are you trying to get into the city? I'm not trying. Tell me about your experience at the gate today. Oh, I haven't even been to the gate. Slow down a second. Who are you? I'm Lens, roving reporter for the Boulder's Mouth Gazette. My editor sent me to cover the drama out here at the gate. He wants some fluff piece about the heroic steel watch keeping the mob at bay. Whether or not that's the truth or not. And what do you think is the truth? A drama is supposed to be impartial. Criticizing a steel watch is not an opinion you hear often. And I'm not interested at all. Goodbye. What do you think is the truth? That the refugees here are desperate, hungry, scared people. They're no mob. They just want to be safe. I've heard the rumors. Absolutists marching from Moonrise Towers. Whole towns felled by strange curses. It's no wonder they ran. Of course, I can't write any of that. My editor only releases stories his friend Lord Gortash approves of. And he's very selective. Mm, that's appalling. So people in the city have no idea what's going on. I'd love to speak with your editor. Where can I find him? Sounds like you're printing Gortash's propaganda. Doesn't it just... Of course, we're off the record and this conversation never happened. Now, if you don't mind, I've got some edits to make. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Who insists? Citizens only. I won't say it again. They won't let us in. And they ask real nice too. Wow. That kid was voiced by an actual kid. There must be something. Hmm. What is down here? Oh, there's a pouch. Wait, I could have walked down here? What is this pouch? Hold on, hold on. Get to, get to the pouch. Nice. Take all. Alright, come down here. <laughs> down here. Down here. Of course. Down here. Wait, wait. What the hell? Rogue's morsel. Okay, cool. Get that. Some mushroom. Shrooms. I'm basically coming here just filling the map. Hmm. Oh wait, no, 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 go back. There's awesome up there. I'll get him all the way back up. What is that? That might be worth a look. Okay. I'm digging a hole, I'm digging a hole. Cone of coal. Come pick up the balls.
Okay. Alright, head back up. Alright, I need to go in here to investigate a death. Wait, hold on. Oof. Do not go there yet. Hey, where are these people? Where'd they go? F5. God, your face, man. Lord Gortash. Refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. I'm not a refugee. No idea what you're talking about. Let me through or I'll kill you. Really? Here I thought this was going to be a boring day. <laughs> Help! I'm being attacked! Are you fucking kidding me? you pile of junk! Hmm, interesting. Temporarily hostile, temporarily hostile. Kipso. Fisselina. Yeah, sure. Hold on. Bonus action. Give me a potion or oh. Yeah, uh go with the drow. Break them. Wait, who's not in combat? Oh, Shadowheart is in combat. Okay, cool. I thought it was somebody not in combat. Carlac, what do you got? Oh, we are going to rage, of course. Ah, <sighs> does she not have an? Oh, she's got the elixir of the Colossus. That's fine. Here, come over this way. Moving. Oh, they are no longer temporary hostile. They're hostile, hostile. Okay. Uh, enter. Catch my breath. Here, you. What is your weakest stat? Oh, it is wisdom. I get a wisdom or dex. Doesn't matter. Let's do dex. Eldritch Blast. One, two, three. No. No. And no. He's dead. Can I fly away? Where can I fly to? Not enough space, not enough space, not enough space. Perfection. Alright, Endern. 
You're gonna fly over, hit this fucker. Oh, why do they go black like that? Uh, no clue. Shield blow. Hmm. All right. And let's do this. What do we got? Dalmaturgy, planar binding, monster flame strike. What is this thing we could get? Lightning vulnerability? It's malfunctioning. Stun temporarily hostile. Fourth level with this. Lift of light more. Can't reach his destination. Why not? Can I move? Let's move around him. Can I do it now? I would hit both of them. Provokes opportunity attack. Do it. Let's do it at fourth level. Right there. Alright, what's everybody doing? Is that bringing the health? Cool, go. Alright, now enter. Okay, cool. Uh, well, how do I not have bonus action? Let's see. Carla, you come here. Reckless? Save War Gods for lesson. Now let's go right here and a shove. Wait, no. Actually, go right. Yeah, it's fine. Go shove. Shove her. Why did it do that? What the fuck? Is she glitched out? I think she might be glitched out, which is fine. Here you go, in turn. Someone inside out. Uh, wait, who is that? Shadowheart? Hmm. Doesn't matter. Come on down. In turn. There. Wisdom. I don't think that it matters. Now, one, two, three. No. No. And no. Uh, intern. You, what are you doing? 
I guess I turned here. God damn it. There. Yeah. Yep, I turned. What the hell is she doing? God damn, that sword's huge. Hmm. I do not have the range for that. Let me... Is it a spell? Eldritch Blast. That one. That one. And... Pat is interrupted! Here, let me move. Hmm. Let me make sure he dies, and then she dies. No, do not give me a look at the far rooms. Let's do that. Okay. Uh, wait, I still got movement. I can move over here. still kind of want bonus for having high ground, but okay, it's fine. It is what it is. <laughs> of course my rage ended. Easy these days. What is this thing's weakest stat? Oh, wisdom, of course. Wait, it has vulnerability to lightning. That shatter. Let's do chromatic orb lightning. Let's do it at third level. Mm, no. Nope. Sorry, Carlac. Shit. All right, enter. What? It saved? Wait, how does she have not have movement left? Eh, it's fine. We'll just use a third level spell. Cast Guiding Bolt. Wait, how does it feel on Radiant Damage? Oh, it's fine on Radiant Damage. It's normal, so that's good. Their little spell. Hit that. Go. What the fuck? Uh, burnt out optics overloaded. Optical circuits. Hex. Electrocuted. The ability chain. Guiding bolt. Detonating and impending. This steel watcher. Preparing to self detonate. Shit. Um, and I'm going to take a short rest. All right. Time to see.
see what new horrors waiting for us. And I'm good. What is this? Pursuit protocol. You attack the still watcher. The still watcher is searching for you across the city. Hmm. I'm gonna wait till that dies down. Citizen. Fist Meadows. Maybe I should reset that. Now they're all after me. Hold on. I'll wait till to see how this turns out at the pursuit protocol if they stop looking for me. That just makes me a bastard. She might have be put out of her misery with a face like that. Yeah, her face was like blue. Like all over the place. Ugh. So. This rock beer is fine. The folks out here are fine. Nobody's. Back right there. Are they clear the streets? Okay, so that's gone. Oh, those two are still there. So now the fists are hostile to me. That's fine. The man's a living legend. Glad you agree. Metal shield. There. Butter bun. I think I might reload because this might be a bad way of doing it. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. Oh. Okay. Well. Here. Let me fucking reload. Retalk to that cunt. <laughs> It's nice to know I can take them. Just wanted to see if I was strong enough. If I had the power. Okay. Gone, Edwina. Her like face is doing it again. Refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. She is glitched. Mm, that'll lead to a fight. I have urgent business in the city. I am not a refugee. I am not a refugee. Well, do you have the means to support yourself? I see. Oh, I have help from the other side if I ever need support. I'm afraid Article 30.1.7 stipulates that religious or spiritual assertions cannot count towards one's proof of self sufficiency. I will repeat. God damn, she's just like all texturing now. Had, do you have means to support yourself? I can wait. What I find in nature. Um, but they're basically making it where you have to bribe your way into it. Um, fine. Right. Article 30.1.5 of the Council's Decree on Extraordinary Wartime Measures. I am confiscating that. The city thanks you for your contribution. Your name? 
Why do you need my name? You are scamming me. Give me your my give me my money back. I'll take it up with the Duke if you don't like it. Now, your name? God, her shit's still glitching out. Uh, why do you need my name? I'm doing the questioning here. Last time. Name? I am Daisy Dewdrop Fluffington. Well met, citizen Fluffington. Your parasite stares. From the construct, you feel connection, resonance. What the hell is that thing? I am a steel watcher, citizen. Here to serve the people of Baldur's Gate in the name of Lord Enver Gortash. State your business. No. That's not even a concern. Deception. I suspect the source of my limitless arcing power resides in a city. Yes. 19 to 22. As long as I don't roll a 1, I'm passing. Yes. Okay, that's a 22. Uh-huh. Eyes open, body still. Hmm. Why? The Watcher will communicate with our new intelligence directorate. They'll determine if you're a threat to the city. Upstanding citizens have no reason to fear. And you are an upstanding citizen, aren't you? Oh, I think this might turn to a fight after all. Hmm. Stand still. Behind the Watcher's gaze, a presence awakens. You are seen. You are known. Whoa. My engine, it's almost... I don't know... Buzzing. Like it's paying attention. Your party's prior transgressions are reflected in its stare, as witnessed by the cult's ever-alert, scrying eyes. It has heard the howls of slaughtered goblins. It has seen the deep shadows of Grimforge, and the stone floors left bloodied. It knows the cold walls of Moonrise Towers, and the cultists who fell there. The Watcher speaks directly into your mind with a voice like poisoned honey. You are marked for special treatment. Not simply an enemy of the people, but an enemy of the Absolute. Come quietly, or die. Huh. Nope. Ready yourself for a fight. Please comply now, citizen. I will interpret any further hesitation as resistance. Then interpret this, this away. Pile of junk. Villains, take heed. God damn it all. Recovery is Find imminent. Little bastards, or I'll have your heads. That will make a great headline. Wait, how come I'm not in combat now? I'm ready. Whatever it takes. What is she doing? Fascinating. What the hell? This unit is damaged, citizen. This unit is damaged, citizen. This unit is damaged, citizen. Still made murder. Still unsolved. I must keep going. Hmm. There's a gilded chest over there. Hold on. Let's get going. How much further can I go? Best be on my way. Yep, there we go. I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. And I made it in. She's glitchy as fuck.
Teresa's caress also has rooms. Looks like they built the bridge and then just kept building. Putting buildings on top of a bridge. Flop house rules. Confuses me for a member of staff. I'd probably break his her face is stretched all the way across. Where does it go? Hold on. That's one long face. Where does it go? Is it on the map? How about the flop house? It has plenty of spares. No. Okay. Hey what, I'm actually gonna save right quick. Like a legit save and reload the whole game. See if that fixes her face. Is this a new way of asserting dominance? I wish. <laughs> Dude, I'll, be, I'll stretch my face across a map every time. Alright. Let me reload the game all together. Fix her face. Alright, cool. There, escape. Quit game. Yes, quit game. And it's gonna go black. And then I am going to reload. No game. <clears throat> All right, boy. Mwah. Oh lord. Odin's takes forever. Mode game. South span checkpoint. What the hell? Ew, Lord. Alright, has her face calmed down? Damaged citizen. All right, let's talk to Fist Meadows. Greetings. All with that, just a thought, one person. Citizen, 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 citizen. Okay, but well what's up here?
don't mind it. Honestly. Very well. Okay, well, let's go back down. Right here. What do you want, sir? Bloody gnomes. We need to find where they burrowed themselves up. You! You an adventurer? Looking to pad your purse? Find their foxhole. Bring me their chief's head. The fist will reward you well. Oh. Head? That sounds radical. Job, I find their hideout. Bring the leader's head. Nah, uh, that sounds like a job for defending a fist. Bring you their head? That sounds radical. You'll change your mind once they kill innocent citizens. The only language they'll understand is that of intimidating violence. Hmm. Sounds like a job for the flaming fist. I agree. But we can't leave our post. Not with all the patriarchs meeting in Worms Rock for the coronation. You've the right look. Solid bones. Steady face. The kind that cleans up vermin for pay. Eh. I'm debating if I should do it. I'll find her hideout and bring the leader's head. Good. Sniff them out. Everybody disapproves. Clean. Keep Baldur's Gate safe. Yeah, I'm probably going to fill that quest. It's done. fine. I'll be around. And reload. That was over here. Hold on. Get underneath here. Hmm. Is this the flop house? Yeah, here we go. And all round pleasant folks, from what I think. And if a patron confuses me for a member of I do probably break his nose. Good thing. Really? Looking for lodgings? Don't bother. All the decent places are gone. Damned coronation. The missus and I have been dreaming about the city. No more sleeping rough. Didn't expect to find it locked down tighter than a watcher's fist. Hmm. Into the flop house. Quick save. The flop house. It has plenty of space. Wonderful we leave scouring places like this. So many victims for Casador here. They're the kind of people no one would ever miss. Alright. Adventure Dream. Bloody ages we spent hiking from Murren. And they won't let us in the city proper. Bollocks. We're adventurous, damn it. There's no respect here. My magic could level the city, but I'm treating like a commoner. You're damn right. I can't believe they wouldn't let us in. The bridge god had some shite about a coronation. Couldn't really make head nor tail of it. Honestly. Rosanna. Come to Baldur's Gate, he said. Adventurers get welcomed as heroes, he said. Poxy Drim and his bleeding notions. Mm. We have time. The runaway is still missing after all. Nothing happens until he's found. Traveler Griska. Flop house rules. Fold sheets need to sit across bunks. No big smells. No tipping janitorial staff. He gets paid plenty. No outside food eaten inside. No marks left on latrine. 
Burn air, indefinite. Ten day hits. A month, ten day late. Kershka, unsure. Five night tens, Rosanna. Hmm. Word to the wise. Give that ill mate to Temple a wide berth. Rude buggers. Certainly not bringing my trade there again. To be fair, their high priest just died. Yeah. To be fair, their high priest just died. Does that excuse being rude? Excluding folk? Come off it. They wouldn't let me in. Spouted some tripe about my sort and absolutist murderers. I only wanted to sit down a minute. I thought priests were meant to be polite. Uh, what's your trade? Let me show you. You have nothing of real use to me except these. And maybe that. Yeah, I shall take all of these. All of these. Yep. Yeah. And that. That. Wisp we that 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 main deal Animal speaking and featherfall. Yeah, that's fine. And visibility. Probably get that to Hysterion. You take that. Mm, yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, take the British necklace. And this extra loot. Okay. Pleasure doing business. Flop house issues. Leave it for restructure. Ha! Huh. This ominous location right here leads me to believe that there is a hit deal in the floor. Harvest. Room and now you look famished. I've got some victuals that'll warm you right up. I am feeling a bit peckish. What do you have? Have a skeg at these. Oh, ugh, ugh. turn my nose up. Nope, I'm good. That should do you. I didn't buy anything. What the hell, this woman? I gotta go upstairs. give me strength. Why does one's crossing have so few lodgings? Second floor. Now what do you reckon, lass? You trust these steel watcher thingy jigs? Nope. Trust him by as far as I could throw him. Oi, I'll second that. It's all right where well, we can get work repairing them, but what happens when they build something else to do that? Uh, it's no good, I tell you. Trims, Quilia. Hail Petrus. Delira. We should go. I do not want to face the master if we're late for his black mass. Soon, sister. I only need one more mark. We have enough for the master. 
No more needed. It's not for the master, it's for me. I spent 100 years eating rats and dogs, but soon I'll be able to feast. I want someone there, ready for me. And once the mass is done and our Lord grants us freedom, I can celebrate by drinking them dry. Cazador promised you your freedom, and you believed him. Ha! You were never burdened with intelligence, Petras. But your load seems especially light these days. Astarian? It... It cannot be. Oh, that's no way to welcome back a brother, Dahl. <laughs> Didn't you miss me? Why would you come back? You got out. You were free. We're here to kill Casador. It's the only way you'll be free. Just tell us about the ritual. What do you know? Of course that's why he came crawling back. He wants to ascend with the rest of us. He heard about the ritual and the power our master will grant us. So he came back with his tail between his legs, hoping all would be forgiven. <sighs> you always were an idiot, Petras. Is he hiding? Tell me! Brother! Please! Uh, talk will burn. Your choice. You heard them. Tell me what I need to know. Now! The Master is preparing the Black Mass. Beneath his palace, there's a defiled chapel. It was hidden there the entire time, hidden from us all. I'm going to stop Cazador. What the hell's happened to you, Astarian? What are you? I'm more than what I was. And I'm not afraid of anything anymore. The sun can't harm me. Cazador can't compel me. I'm the only person who can stop him. Now go, before I change my mind about roasting you, brother. This isn't over, Astarian. <laughs> Poor fools. They actually think Cazador will save them. Hmm. They'll warn him we're coming. We should have killed them. They're no threat to us. And they have no choice but to do Cazador's bidding. I pity them. Worst of all, they don't know their fate's already set. <laughs> They're doomed. The only question is whether their lives will be sacrificed to a monster like Cazador or serve a greater purpose. Seven sigils on seven spawn. And Cazador has the other six. We have to face him and take that power for ourselves. Are your brothers and sisters, are you ready to sacrifice him? Hmm. Why not stay away? Casador can't finish the ritual if he can't find you. For ourselves. For yourself, you mean. Sometimes you scare me more than the Elder Breed does. So let's do it. For yourself, you mean. So let's do it. I knew I could count on you. We share that killer instinct and now we know that Cazador's skulking somewhere beneath the palace it'll be infinitely easier to track him down all right let's go this place stinks of rat blood and despair okay well how do I get upstairs is this the room I need to go to? Can I go in there? Let's go. Hmm. 
That's the bath bathhouse. So let's go here, 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 here. There's another floor. I go up the floor. The ladder. This should be cake. Cake. Piece of cake. <laughs> when your face is right now, it's over her body. So it was her face instead of hers. I love it. Oh. I wouldn't have paid attention to that. No, oh, I missed it. I have to watch it back when I edit. Stir on. Let's have some fun. What? How is that possible? Uh, try again. Twenty-five. There. What to do? Temple plans. What is this? Bloodstained parchment. Temple plants. Torn parchment. Hmm. I make them offering. Blah, blah, blah. Bring the power through your worth. Higher core. Temple plants. These were full of shapeshifters. Father Logan's name is written here too. Cap. Yeah, pick up. Bloodstained parchment. Hmm. Those wishing to face the Dread Lord Tribunal and enter the Temple of Baal must slay the targets on this list and frame the corpses as a murder by the cult of the Absolute. Bring the victim's hand as proof for the killing. Walk in blood as spirit. Duke Stelmane, Father Lorgan, Dribbles the Clown. Wait, why triples the clown? The hell? Alexander Rainforest. Frank Pertry. Cora Highberry. Figaro Pennygood. Chief Rover. Nishalisha. A very, very Vanthaper. And Frederick Harm. Hmm. Well, we got proof that there's people here being murdered. Anything of use? Blood near the bed. Scarlet leather armor. Safe, my love. I'm here. I won't let anything happen to you. Hmm. Bloodstained note. Hmm. Send a pouch. Oh, hell yeah. Fatismal killer, call spray. Oh no, that. Take. Blood. You notice some blood has pooled on the wooden floor. Investigation. Boom. Boom. Fourteen. Good. 
notice the blood source, a body hidden under the bed. Put the body up. Come over here. God damn, why are y'all crowding everything? Get over here. What's hiding here? Ion's key. key. It's identical to the one held by that corpse in the tunnels. Hmm, speak with dead? Alright, before I speak with dead, hold on. Let me quick save. I need to run to the restroom right quick. I'll be right back, Jack. Just be with me. Patience. Why kill dribbles? So confused by that. The corpse regards you lifelessly. How did you die? Murdered. What does your son look like? Dwarf, like me, dresses in red. Hmm, that guy. Why did your son kill you? Well, I know why. Um, why did your son kill you? His secret, my sweet boy. One, two, three, Why? four, and five. What was your son's secret? Killed folk slowly. He liked it. Hmm. Who was your son's next target? Yeah, that's the last question. Ill Mater Temple didn't see exactly who. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Oh, 
Well, that didn't solve anything. Hold on. Deal with the gnomes. Yeah. Familiar of the ballless murderer in Fager's flop house. A target list is the layer details. The killer's instructions slay specific Baldorians and frame D absolute for it. About the organ, priest of the nearby open hand temple is named Lilith. Perhaps we should warn someone. Okay. Who's on the list? No, not that note. I need that one. Blood stained parchment. Cora Highberry. Serif and Thumper. Frederick Hewn. Mm, wait, hold on. Is there. Showing a map? To investigator Valeria. You've been pulling all nighters to keep watch. I know you have. Well, I do. Can't oh, slow down again in a real and an epic curse. Oh, well, hold on. <laughs> Arthur Gregorio. Hmm. Mamzelle and Mira. A weary traveler, battered and bruised. You come for sustenance. No. Decadence. A mien cool as ice, yet eyes burning hot. Oh, yes, I know your bliss. A sturdy dwarf, a leather whip, she gives, you receive. Or have I misjudged you? I have a spot on that sounds survival. Not my first choice, but I wouldn't say no. Can we not talk about this? You're way off, I'm afraid. Hmm. You're way off, I'm afraid. Am I? Your eyes tell a story, sweeting. You crave more than pleasure. You crave penance. It's Fion you seek, our stern librarian. She isn't here today, alas. Your penance must wait. Fion is dead. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. Choose your sin. Hmm. Let's be back tomorrow. Hmm. You have a drow escorts on hand? Does sound tempting. Are there other options for companionship? In the flop house lies a flesh fresh killed corpse of Lady Dwarf. Could that be for you? Murdered! Ye gods, the poor thing! Oh, by the mother of cats, I pray she didn't suffer. They'll miss that face. Else, the regulars will miss her more. They swarmed her like honeybees at the hive. Oh. Losing Fion slashed a big hole in my coin purse. I should get to replacing her. A woman is dead and you're concerned about money? Spare reward for this information. I have little coin, but I offer sin in abundance. Talk with the drow twins in the tap room. They're legends among the regulars, almost myths. Tell them they will gift from the Mamzelle, and let them show you why. Anything else on your mind, sweeting? Hmm. Leave. Kira, the cat. Huh. 
come to pay your respects to the real lady of the house, I see. What a clever creature you are. It's your lucky day. I am receiving compliments at this time, and you are most welcome to make an offering. Oh. Why should I? Your eyes are too... Baleful jewels that strike fear into the most complacent of rats. Your paws are fit to overturn only the daintiest crystal wear. Your glorious tail can trip an unsuspecting servant with the grace of an empress. I have got better things to do than compliment a cat. Try and pet the cat. Hmm. Eh, let's humor the cat. Oh, you are quite correct. I consider them one of my finest features. The unwashed rabble who frequent this establishment have much to learn from your deference. And I must suffer their foibles alone. But they do say a burden shared is a burden halved. Hmm. What's that shady pair over there whispered about? Do I want to know about who's through those fancy curtains? What are your thoughts of the clientele as a whole? Hmm, what are the shady pair over there whispered about? Can't you hear from here? They're talking about the new top cat in the criminal underbelly. Go and listen for yourself. As for them personally, one never washes and instead douses himself with rose oil, while the other can't hold his drink. Hmm. Now who's through those fancy curtains? The Drow, two of our most popular courtesans. A night with them seems to be rather life-changing, if you can afford it. Of course, they are siblings, but judging from the throngs of clients they draw, most of the city is as disgusting as they are. Hmm, what are your thoughts on clientele as a whole? That's rather a broad topic. We get all sorts here. But there is one frequent visitor whose very presence offends me. He dresses fabulously, but stinks of the hells. Something infernal, to be sure. Abhorrent. Raphael. I put it on Corilla? Corilla is that one. I wanna give it a good... Damn, Hoots! That new batch burns stronger than a pit fiend's fist. I'll take that as a compliment. Take it however you want. But I'll be having my usual from now on. Something's off about this one. On your guard. Oh. <laughs> it's Raphael's favorite misadventurer. Good to see you again. Even if you have put me out of pocket. The boss bet me five soul coins you'd reach the city in one piece. He rented a room upstairs in the hope that you'd drop by. Who are you exactly? What does he want from me? I should have stayed home. I have no intention to speak with him. Who are you exactly? Oh, I forget we've never met. I've had my eyes and ears on you so long we feel like old friends. Carilla, is I my know. name. I'm Raphael's assistant, shall we say. Take your time. Have a drink. Sample the goods. Go see him when you're feeling refreshed. Mm. There's a bunch of stuff in here. Hold on. I gotta go. I barely got a moment's sleep. Alright. Talk to the fist. You're looking parched, sweetheart. Another tankard? Hells, darling. Another sip and I'm like to spill over. But other anchoring for spicier flavours. 
How about you give me a taste? Hmm, I think it's time for you to get out of here, buddy. I think it's time you shut your gob, buddy. Don't worry your pretty head about the fist, love. I can play them all like a loop. Distasteful behavior. You're ranking offers should know about this. Let her handle this. I want to do deception though. Hmm. Oh, as long as I don't roll one, I'm good. A 39. Wow. Oh, else. Last thing I need is the manip on my ass. See you around, doll. Keep that fire stoked for me. Damn it all, that guy's loaded. You just chased off a full coffer of tips. But I've still got one tip left, just for you. Don't stand between a gal and her gold mine. Heh, <laughs> deal. Good. Now I can talk to the bartender since he's out of my fucking way. Russell Dirinia's feathers, eh? Well, no harm done. A moneymaker catches more fists than a frog catches flies. Do what? She just. Yeah, I'm gonna repeat it. Her moneymaker catches more fists than a frog catches flies. Yeah, okay. All right. This game, I swear. Show me what you have. Your new bruise, Sal Potent. I'll give that a try. What's the story about this place? Better bar keeping this place here is all sorts of stories. My business is slinging tankards, not hoarding secrets. I'd like to keep it that way. But, you poke some folk hard enough, they're bound to squeal. And Mamzella Myra there looks New about insult ready to unlocked. burst. Honestly, I don't think she would have taken it as an insult. Mm. Let me see what else you have. Show me what you have. You got it. But the new hooch is off limits. Can't have the Mamzell leaping down my throat if I go burning yours. Mm. Wait, hold on. I can have. Hold on. Pleasure to serve. Your new brew sounds potent. I give that a try. Don't know about that, chum. Hoots hooch packs a stronger wallop than all ten of my knuckles. Could beef you up, sharpen your tongue, or knock you out cold. No telling till the first drop hits your gullet. I'll take my chances on the hooch. Damn! The gal knows what she wants. First one's on the house. So, don't come bawling to me if your big toes fall off or your tongue coils in a knot. Really? That's the story of this place. Caress, caress. The mamsel's brainchild. Wet your tongue, soak your skin, scratch your itch. Mm. Get the attention you want, and avoid the attention you don't. Hoots Hooch. Wait, what happened? That was a wild magic surge. Hold on. Hooch, photosensitivity. Become blind at the wrecked sunlight, but gain superior dark vision. Oh, I basically become a drow. Now, that there 
there's a face I'd remember if I'd seen it. Welcome to Charesse's Caress. What can Hoots do for you, stranger? You got a taste for ale, I reckon. Or maybe... Ah, forget it. My new brew could drop you in the wink of a spectator's eye. Hmm. Lee Sampolden, what do you have? Try Hoots Hooch. Cuts real deep. I've already had it. What is this? Amulet of the Drunkard. Turn while drunk. Additional increases the duration of your inebriation by five rounds. Who's Hooch? Hmm. Eh. I actually don't want it. Pleasure to serve. Please. Time to confront this arsehole. Are these the Drow twins? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nim and Sorn. Queen Roll the Despoiler. Monsieur Chapam and it says, okay. Arthur, Greg Ryu. Nine hells! You followed me all the way here? What could you possibly want with me now? You found the explosive toy bears. You detonated. You donated to the refugees. What? How? Nine hells. Whatever you think you know, I, I, I'm sure some gold would help you to forget. I'm here to see you over all the justice. Keep your gold. I want answers. Uh, if I were after gold, I would have gutted you and taken it. Please don't. What do you want from me? It's not my fault. I was forced to do this. Framed even. They would have killed me if I refused to rig the toys. And they're definitely going to kill me now. They. Who is this day? Over your head. All right, get going. Uh, they. Whose is they? I can't tell you. I won't tell you. Well, either you die here or they kill you. Tell me who they are or you'll be dead before they even get to you. It's uh, 13 plus 17. Okay. Or at least a 14. So, that's 20. Nice. All right. All right. Just don't hurt me. The teddy bears were an experiment. My greatest invention clever little device in their chest allows them to speak but there's more smoke powder inside the device I collect packages from Veloga's fireworks in the lower city and stuff the bears with it not because I want to because I have to <laughs> otherwise they'll kill me who's they you still haven't told me who they are. I don't know who's in charge, but it starts at the fireworks shop. That's where the packages come from. Go there. Tell them Uncle Philogia sent you, and they'll show you the smoke powder. Lots of it. There. I told you what you wanted to know. Uh, now, will you let me go? No. This plea comes with an offering. A pass granting you access to the lower city. What's this? Bribery? The only place you're going is prison. I appreciate it, but... But now I know all that, I don't think I can let you go. Sorry. Thanks, but I'll need all your gold, too. Take it! All of it! I don't care! You'll <laughs> never see me again, I promise! <laughs> Oh, 
Mm-mm-mm. Archducal coordination and mission pass. I have overstocked. I'm fucking all the inspiration. I have too many inspirations. Quest. Mm. Impress. Bring a severed hand as proof we can stand before the murder tribunal and enter the temple of Baal. Deal with the devil. Investigate there. We interrogated Arthur, and he confessed to donating exploded toys. He claimed he was getting instruction spots from the lower city. We should investigate. Okay. Investigate Calzador's palace. Um, investigate the murders. Disable to steal watch. Okay, cool. In that case, I gotta do a deal with the devil. And then avenge the iron hands and whatnot. Um, Let's head over here. The two men bark softly to each other. A single name reaches your ears. Nine Fingers. Mm. It's a name you know. Nine Fingers is the head of the guild, a criminal organization operating inside Baldur's Gate. Mm. Talking about Nine Fingers, I've got business with her. That's a 19. So as long as I don't roll a 1, I'm good. 17 total. Jesus. Oh, yeah. Seems everyone's got business with her. Heard the gal met her match. The new kingpin? All meat and muscle, that one. And wild as a werebear. If he's looking to house nine fingers, my blade's got his back. Sounds messy as the ninth hell. Must be why she called us to help. Is that right? The way I heard it, you Zent cut a deal with the new... Hold on. Hey, you still lurking about? I don't remember inviting you to the party. Hmm. Detect thoughts. Oof. Oh god, that was close. Nine fingers won't be happy about Zenovia, and I'm not about to tell her. In your area, I need to talk to Nine Fingers about Zenovia. Hmm. Better you than me. Now listen, I'll only say this once: Lower City, Basilisk Gate, Guildhall, and that's all you're getting from me. Now scram! The chat's officially closed. Talk to him again because I'm an idiot. For more company. Oh, oh, y'all are no fun. Hey, who is this down here? 
Yes, the chef. His name is Chorizo. Not that type of service down here, love. I've got a husband. And you ain't my type. Hmm. Got any food going spare? Mm, I'm not looking for service, thank you. I can do better than you anyway. Uh, could you show you pleasures your husband's never could? I'm not looking for your service, thank you. Oh, thank the gods. I've had too many miscreants think my kitchen's just another themed playroom. Hmm, got any food going spare? I suppose, if you're willing to pay for it. Yeah, uh, not really. Oh, he's got a salami. 24 plus bludgeoning. Now hmm. get out from an. Okay, 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 fine, I'll go. Going inside was that human boy insisting What is down there? Let's go upstairs first. A citizen there. Okay, so I gotta talk to the Holly font. I think this is a Holly font. Okay. Examine. Yep, he's a Holly font. Another case closed, another bottle open. Huzzah to Valeria! Your case is a close. You're an idiot. I recognize that face. You were talking to Yanis after I left the temple. I bet she's put you up to something. We're just here to drink. Afraid so. I found new evidence, investigator. Hmm. She asked me, seeing as you can't be bothered. Ah, uh, found new ev evidence, investigator. Why must you busybodies insist on interrupting a perfectly good night? <sighs> uh, I know that look. You remind me of Devella. Fine! If you doubt my conclusions, out with it. What have you found? Who's Devella? Morgan's murder is just one part of a bigger plot. A ball plot. Hmm, found the murderer weapon you missed in a tunnel under the temple. Spoke with Father Logan's corpse. Uh, he was killed by a dwarf dressed in red. Not real gore. I found another body in the flop house nearby. I think it's related. A group of shape shifting assassins were under the temple, along with more murder victims. Open a note. Who's Tavella? My assistant. She's posted in the lower city investigating Duke Stelmane's murder. Now, back to it. What have you found? Hmm. They're all related. Part of a bigger plot. A ball plot. A ball plot. You as well. Tavella's been harping on about Baal for months. Fancies herself something of an expert. I assumed it was just a bunch of conspiracy cods wallop and fear-mongering. But she's been unusually insistent about this one, even for her. Oh, fine. I'll bite. What's your theory? It's not a theory. <laughs> I have proof the document contains information connecting the murders to the ballless resurgence. No need to wave documents at me. I'm already drowning in paperwork as it is. Constable Devella is going to be a real pain in the trunk about this. Since you seem to be on an obnoxiously similar wavelength, why don't you seek her out? She'll be at the Elf Song Tavern. Show her the list and I'll stay and inform the fist here. Oh, and you'll need this pass. It'll give you access to the lower city. No. Keep this up, I'm gonna have like 40 passes. Well, what are you waiting for? You have a bloody conspiracy to solve. Move! No. You can't tell me what to do. 
Citizen, citizen, citizen. Citizen, send it. Citizen, citizen. Citizen, citizen, citizens. All these people are useless. I don't need any of them. Hmm. So that leads me upstairs to go talk with. What's his name? I don't want to talk to. What's his name? But I will. Okay, quick save, just in case. I don't have to do all of that again. Double doors. Pleasure isn't just physical, it's a state of mind. That doesn't make any sense. It will when you've met the drought. Wait, how do I... Wait, give me, give me quest. Investigate the murders, no. A the Underduke. Pretty asset. Uh deal with the gnomes. Yep, the devilish hawks. Find them all. Hold on. No, I need Deal with the devil, that one. Mm, Ralph, what is Rusker? She told us her master awaits for us on the top floor. Okay. Yep, here we go. 18. Cool. Grotto. Wait, is this the top floor? Where is Raphael? Or can I go up further? Is there a further way up? Hmm. You don't have to think about a thing. I want to, but I just have such a headache. I wish I could. Let's go in here. What's going on here? Tell me, am I beautiful? More than beautiful. You are the aurora stretched across the north skies. You are the golden dunes swept across the Kalim. Hmm. Sounds like a lie to get money. You are the fruit of the forbidden palm soft on my skin sweet on my tongue you are my sin and salvation your parasite stirs and you gaze at the nymph through the flaming fists hungry eyes your muscles shiver with her longing. Your skin burns with her heat. What's... What's wrong, Jara? What are you... Wait! I know you! Hmm... Whoever you think I am, you're mistaken. It's personal. I should leave. Whoever you think I am, you're mistaken. Your face! The Absolute has shown me. Jara, what's going on? Who's this woman? Gather. Your head screams in agony. The change has come. Pustules boiling beneath your skin, your bones twisting, your flesh rupturing. And suddenly, silence. 
Oh, she has been turned. What's happening? She's becoming a mind flare. Oof. Uh, everybody's in combat right now. Okay, cool. Nice. Not enough movement to fly over here, so you can... There, go. Alright, end that thing's turn. Karlak. Here, I need you to... Turn all the way up here. No, I need you to run all the way over here and then do this. Yes. I'm going to enjoy this. Wait, who is that? The random citizen ended up in here. Reckless. All right, that's it. For the slaughter. Not enough movement. What? Sneak attack range. Go. Yep. Offhand attack. In turn. I don't even need to do any of that. You're dead. Counterspell? Psionic Blacklash. Either way, it died. <gasps> it didn't have a... No! No, it didn't have... Reload. Where was I at? No, I think there's something going on with the internet. Yeah, it says my bitrate is unstable. But it's fine now. I loaded back over and it should be picking back up. I don't know why, but it is. Yeah, it says it's at half the kilobytes of what it's supposed to be. This is on Twitch now. My side's fine. Hmm. Yeah, okay. There it goes. It's working fine now. What the hell? I'm not interested in sex, but thanks. Uh, you just give me a few coins instead. Just give me a few coins instead. <laughs> I offer something rarer than coin. Rapture. Close your eyes. And listen. Hmm. Alright, fine, you got me. You see only darkness. Her voice shines through it, warmer than the sun. Twitch a bitch until night. they start playing you. The yeah, I know. Being. Here, there is no suffering. Here, you want for nothing. Here, you are anything. You have one word. Tell me, what will you be? Powerful. You are more than powerful. An emperor to emperors, your head adorned with a crown of gold, diamond, and ruby. The heavens tremble. Where's this lady's clothes? Got a whole thong up her butt. All beasts, <laughs> all men and women, all creatures. She lost him in the battle. Bow to your might. Your flesh shivers, your heart bursts. True ecstasy for one fleeting moment. Open your eyes. I remember you. 
And you will remember me. Lost. <laughs> She's trying to be a distraction for the mind player. Okay. Now nah, she didn't have any clothes on from the get go. Okay. From the get go. Did I get a bonus or anything? Rapture. Affected entity gets one plus one d6 bonus to attack rolls, ability checks, and saving throws until the next long rest. I. I'm about to take a long rest like here really soon. So this here was. Can I come back and get it? Mm, I don't know. Seems simple enough. It's working. She knew what was coming. What the hell? Trust no one. With pleasure. <gasps> what? Try again. There we go. 34. Way better. Is that blood? No. Where the hell am I supposed to meet up with what's his name? Monk sword, leather armor. Room's key. Yeah, let me go get that. Hold on. Wait, I could have used that on a damn thing over there. What the hell? Arc do coronation admin pass. Yep, I got three passes. What the hell? You do have rocks for brains. What were you thinking? Ah, yeah. You haven't even got inside yet. Oh, this was... At the ready. Okay, there ain't shit out here. I'm here. I don't let Okay, come over here. El Minster's Library? Moan loudly in the library at all times. Wait, what did that say? Hold on. Just Moan loudly in the library at all times. What? Elminster, hey, you are one creepy old man. What is this one? The Devil's Den. Hmm. Devil's Den. This is... All of Charest Caress? Like all the way around over here? What the hell? Doesn't make any sense. Alright, let's go here. It will when you bet the drought. Uh okay. Silver there. Another dog collar. Beyond's journal. There's blood. Mm, I am too. ABC. <laughs> the lich is in me. Yes, come get the dog car. Okay, so that's over there is where I meet Kithrak Voss. Hmm. Well, what? Read.
one night in the shkia. Yep, oh, okay. Soap sponge there. Rules of the reading room. What book is this? Read. Read. Use a box sponge there, blah, 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 here. Double doors, go over here. Okay, so this gets me to the roof. Get me all the way over there. Oh god. There is Baldur's Gate. Hmm. Okay. This doesn't really help me though. Like, what's the point of coming up here? There was no point. No point at all. Nothing. Damn, it seems like every quest is in here. Wait, hold on a second. That's how I can get in there. What's in here? nothing in here only though I think that's where the two the drought twins go in that case I need to go back over here and climb up come over here to the back side jump down six hit points what the fuck hold on 13 I saw one where it was three. Can I do that? Can I? Hold on. Feather fall? Can I feather fall? Is there a potion? Scroll. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. All right. Locked. Ready. How dare you be locked? Ostris. Total twenty five. Nice. Nobody is locked. 
No locked doors here for you. Any foul whim, name the price. Is there anything duller than a loyal dog? I much prefer a cat. Meow. You must hear me, devil. I will do whatever it takes, give you anything you ask. There is only one thing in this world that I desire. You do not have it, and you never will. Oh, what is that, Raphael? You must help me, Raphael, for the sake of my people. Hush now, Voss. These guests may not know it yet, but they want the same thing that you do. And unlike you, they have something of value to offer in return. Whatever you discuss with this devil, I must hear of it. Find me below in the tap room once you're loosed from his claws. I'm glad you came. Not to my door, not yet, but to the final reckoning. One more thing before we begin, though. For the first time since the Nautiloid, your mind is clear. It's unsettling. Did you just carry me at a tap hole with a click of your fingers? I feel empty. What did you do? I gave you back your privacy by shutting that illithid in your pocket out of your mind. It can't hear us. Huh. What's the catch? I trust the Illithid more than I trust you. And speak freely. Tell me why you brought me here. Clever. But when we first met, you promised me a cure. This is it a cure. And speak freely. Tell me what you brought me here. I brought you here because I'm true to my word, and I can make all of this tadpole business go away. Which means you and your lovely friends can remain blessedly free of tentacles. Unless some have already sprouted in places I can't see. Let us speak plain. I'll admit, you've impressed me. I wasn't sure you'd make it this far. But no matter how far you come, you're still on the road to ruin. A road that leads directly to a confrontation with the Elder Brain. At best, it will kill you and everyone else in this city. At worst, it will assimilate you, and you won't have enough free will left to even wish you were dead. You have the key to destroying it in the palm of your hand, though. Orpheus. Very perceptive. Yes. I can give you the means to break him free. Orpheus guards tried to kill me. It's dangerous. Why would I want to free him? I suppose you'd rather suck on the Emperor's tentacles till the end of your days? Orpheus is your only hope of surviving this horror show without devolving into an illithid. To you, he will be a friend. After all, 
You're at war with an elder brain. To be fair, the Mind Flayer, despite who he may be, the Emperor, yes, he did lie to me, but that's expected. He's the only one that has it enslaved me. He's left me to my own devices and my own free will. I, I'm sided with the Mind Flayer on this one. I've seen suggest Orpheus is my enemy and the Emperor my ally. The Emperor is the only reason why I'm still alive. No. Orpheus is the only reason you're still alive. The Emperor is abusing the gift for its own ends. And it's doing the same to you. You're nothing more than the beast of burden that will transport it to the Elder Brain. An ox requires food. And the occasional beating to keep it moving. You are simpler. The Emperor's words serve as both carrot and stick. Perhaps it is true that Orpheus would ally with you against the Elder Brain. But if he proves uncooperative once free, you may have to kill him. I don't know is it worth taking the risk how do i free orphics the orphic hammer an artifact capable of shattering the chains that hold prince orpheus is held securely in my house of hope even now It's very convenient that you have exactly what I need. Isn't it just? And it's even more convenient that you can give me exactly what I want in return. There it is. Of course. Hmm. He wants the stones. What are you hoping to get out of all of this? I suppose you want my soul in exchange for the hammer. No. Just tell me what you want. I'm not bargaining with you, Raphael. Just tell me what you want. I want the crown that dominates the elder brain. There it is. Tent it, but tell me why you're so eager to get a hold of the crown. And to give you a powerful artifact to a double. Um, oh, Gail's already told me about the crown. It's a ancient Netherese um, thingamajig. It's a Netherese Empire tech. So, second edition tech? Yeah. What exactly is the crown? I already know. Um, it'd be insane to get such a powerful artifact to a devil. Better to have it in my hands, and far from your precious world, than in the hands of the gods and monsters that fight over this city's soul. Hmm. Raphael wants to crown, because he wants to usurp the leader of one of the layers of hell, one of the nine hells. Probably Zario. He wants to take control. Or he wants to enslave the leader. And he needs that crown to do it. Hmm. Tempted, but tell me why you're so eager to get a hold of the crown. I have craved it ever since the Archwizard Casas created it long centuries ago. And brought doom to the Empire of Netheril. That was the great age of humanity, and Netheril's flying sky cities were the apex of civilization. I was there the day it all fell apart. Entire cities plummeted from the sky, like angels with broken wings. The screams, oh, the screams. Hundreds of thousands of people watching in horror as the ground came up to meet them. 
It was not a happy meeting. And Cassus was responsible. Not driven by malice, but by ambition. He forged a crown imbued with all the powers of magic. A crown that would make any who wore it a god. Men cannot contain so much power. The crown destroyed its creator, and his empire fell with him. Cassus's folly, the bards and scholars call it. I call it hope. The hope of creating a better world, and the perils of unchecked hubris. I knew then that the folly of mortals could be the triumph of devils, and that I could use that crown to unite the Nine under one Archdevil Supreme. Me. He's wanting to go after Asmodeus, <laughs> or Asmodeus. Zariel wouldn't like that much. Mm -mm. But even I'm not so desperate to spite her I'd put the Hells in this bastard's hands. The Wizard of Waterdeep. Mmm. How do you ruin all nine hells? Does fill me with joy. Does it fill me with joy? Mmm. I think you make a fantastic Archdevil Supreme. What makes you think you succeed in using the crown where Karsus couldn't? Why didn't you take the crown there and then? You know, and use this power myself. Mmm. This seems like a choice I can't go back on. Because I want the crown for myself. I'll take the crown and use its power myself. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm sorry, you were serious? The crown has laid low all who attempt to harness its power. Archwizards, emperors, gods. It would tear you apart. Yeah, I... <laughs> Why didn't you take the crown there and then? The archdevil Mephistopheles snatched up the crown and squirreled it away in one of his vaults. He is not more than a frigid archivist. So much power and potential kept inert. He made a miracle into a museum piece. I raged. But only for a decade or so. Then I waited, ever watching for more than a thousand years for a mistake, a mishap, a misadventure. And these chosen, who have caused you so much trouble accidentally, did me a favor. They brought the crown back into play. Hmm, it must really annoy you that some mortals managed to steal the crown when you couldn't. How did they come to have the crown? I'll make sure. I'll make you so sure. What makes you so sure I'll get the crown? Hmm, get the crown when you couldn't. Yes, it does. Especially when I see what a bloody mess they've made of their whole scheme. They must have raided Mephistopheles' vault. Impressive, I must admit. But they'll be dead soon. If you don't kill them, the Elder Brain will. It doesn't have feelings in the way you'd understand them. <laughs> but it seems rather angry. It is inevitable. When you destroy the Brain, and you will because you must, the crown will be yours for the taking. And when that moment comes, you give the crown to me. In exchange, I give you the hammer now. A simple transaction, it seems, but it's more than that. He's offering you an alternative to the mind flare in your head. Take Raphael's deal and you could free Orpheus. With Orpheus free, he would have no need to rely on the Emperor. But there's no guarantee that Orpheus would be on your side. And if you take the deal, you'll have to fulfill it. You'll have to deliver the crown of Carsus to the devil himself. He claims his ambition is to unite the Hells, but can he be trusted to stop there? Do 
you trust him more than you trust the Emperor? Mm, I'd rather destroy the crown than risk it falling in the wrong hands again. No deal, Raphael. I'm leaving. I won't stop you. But time is running out. So, don't stay away for long. If you see reason, I'll be here, waiting. Right up to the moment the world ends. Wait, what the hell? It just teleported me out of the room? And then it overs... Or saves. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> I'm not coming in to talk to you. Hold on. I want the loot to place. <laughs> there you are. I thought I'd lost you. Something was blocking me from hearing your thoughts. I know, I was worried. I know, I was worried. Me too. It's concerning that something could come between us like that. Especially when we are so close to the Elder Brain. Do you have any idea what it was? Hmm. It was Raphael. Raphael. Thank you for your honesty. Of course, I should have known the devil would come sniffing. The stench of impending chaos is irresistible to them. And what did he want with you? Mm. He wants the crown that's on the brain. Giving a devil what he wants sounds like a brilliant idea. And what did he offer you in return for bringing it to him? The means to free Orpheus. Tell me, you turned him down. I turned him down. Good. I am glad. But be careful. The devil is like a cockroach. No matter what you do to it, it will always come back. I doubt this will be the last time you are approached. I trust that you will continue to remember who is really on your side. Without my protection, you cannot defeat the Elder Brain. You cannot even get close to it, no matter what the devil whispers in your ear. Something good here, I hope. What the hell? Hmm, okay. What is this? A verse epic. Hmm. Here, I'll take that. Pick it up. White pawn? Wait, hold on. What? I'll give it a shot. White pawn, you are to find a high profile unsolved crime and confess to it. Turn yourself into Porter after arranging in Baldur's mouth for coverage. You know which reporter to use. Your position in the FF barracks, Flame Fist Barracks, should make it easy to identify a crime that, when resolved, will add greatly to Porter's renown. That will cancel your debt. Don't worry about the why. It's a pawn's place to be sacrificed so other pieces can win the game. Hmm. White Bishop orders. White Bishop, prepare yourself for a major speech in your temple, extolling Flame Porter for her success protecting the city and fighting crime. She is clearly a favorite of both mortals and immortals, and you can hint that fate and destiny may conspire to place her in command of Baldur's Gate. 
your sermon will be uh, printed and full of Baldur's mouth. So remember that you are the speaking, not just to Helm's devotees, but to every citizen of the gate. Orate, elevate, and inspire. That will cancel your debt. And I don't doubt that you will end up as a key player in the new regime. Ready yourself. Huh. White Knight, your task is fully at hand. A commander of the Sea Tower. You're close to all the sub-commanders of the Flaming Fist. Sound them out as their willingness to support the possibility of Flame Fortress promotion to Marshal, and perhaps even beyond. Encourage those who are lukewarm to be prepared to rank themselves behind Porter when events elevate her in power and prominence. However, for those who would oppose her, don't push them. Just make note of their names and positions and what and they will be dealt with by other means. This will counsel your depth and doubtless line up you, you for greater responsibilities as well. Prepare yourself. Hmm. Yeah, give me give me that. Grab it. Hmm. Invasion plans at Baldur's Gate. Wait, why does Raphael have invasion plans for Baldur's Gate? He's playing both sides. Okay. More at stake here. Let's go. Of course. Set your worries at ease. Kithrick Voss. Quick save before I talk to him. Tell me you took the devil's deal. Tell me you will free Gith's heir. No, I will find another way to liberate Orpheus. I will find another way to liberate Orpheus. Hmm. I did not come this far for you to turn your back on the first mother's son. And yet it seems I have no choice but to trust. There is but one prism, and you are its key. Find a way to retrieve the hammer and free Orpheus from the prism. I will assemble his remaining honor guard and plan our next actions. Together, we will yet free the true heir of Gith's blessed empire. He will free us from Vlakith and lead our Kithraki against the Geich. Iztik, I will wait in the underground. Seek me when you have the hammer in hand. Orpheus sensed the tadpole before and his guard attacked. Won't he attack? If we free him? The Prince of the Comet aches for Gith Yankee liberation more than he abhors Geich. He might seethe when you free him. He might gnash his teeth and slander your name. But he will see reason. I promise you. Any idea where Raphael might keep the Orphic Hammer? A devil of Raphael's stature does not simply make camp on the shores of the Styx. He will have made a sanctuary for himself, a lavish one too, one that caters to his many vices. He must keep the Orphic Hammer there. Every house has an entrance, Istik, even those in the Hells. You must find it. 
You are wasting your time and mine. Our true enemy is the Elder Brain. Focus your mind there. Hmm. Okay. to start an argument. I just want to know why you turned the boss down. Hmm, I'm still considering my options. Doesn't matter why, my word is final. No deal. Did he tell you to try and win me over with your charms? Cheeky. We might be in a brothel, but I'm not that kind of gal. You should reconsider, though. The boss might be a devil. But he'll treat you more honestly than anyone else in the city. What exactly is it you do for him? I doubt that. There are plenty of good people here. Maybe you're right. Bullshit. Bullshit. Listen. Because I'll only say this once. This fight isn't just about Borders Gate or the Sword Coast or even Faerun. If the brain wins, the Illithid Empire returns and worlds you've never even dreamed of will die. Raphael can stop it. He wants to. And he knows how. You're the key. You always have been. Maybe. I rejected him too easily. Uh, then why make demands of me instead of just helping? Believe a devil cares about the fate of the world. Brain without his help. Then why make demands of me instead of just helping? He's a devil. It's his nature. He needs to get his due. Hmm. I don't believe a devil cares about the fate of this world. I, I don't either, but yeah. He's an altruist. But he's looked at the balance sheet. No world. No souls. And it's hard to get leverage on an illithid. They make terrible clients. I'm not convinced. I thought the brain without his help. I doubt it. But even if you do, you won't survive the fight. I'd reconsider if I were you. Hmm... Alright, where, where am I? Shiresh's caress isn't just about just wetting your whistle. Dancing, dinner. Finest fish caught this morning. What'll it be? Sorry, what does he got? Nope, I do not want to buy fish. Fresh. It will when you've met the drought. What the fuck did they just do? You look like someone whose soul needs feeding. Care to buy some art? Hmm, let's take a look. What does he got? Oh, he's got all these dyes. What is that? Custard and pink rose. Lush burgundy. Blue dye. Hmm. Do come again. What the fuck? Why? What the hell? There's a house. Den of decadent delights. Are you sure? Okay, what's on the map over here? Oh wait, no, that's Raphael. Hmm. That's trading, betraying the gnomes. Not doing that. Quests. Disable to steal watch. Free Orpheus help Kithrick Voss. 
deal with the devil. Oh, three of these are only. Of water to eat. Seek with the bookseller or sorcerer sundry. Spoke with the devil Raphael. Seek a legendary Netherese artifact, a crown of crosses. Not a brain. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. I have a lot of side quests. A lot of bullshit. Get the death door. Nelson Oaks, is this? Fruit, vegetables. What can I do you for? The hell? If you're hungry, you know where to find me. No. No, I don't need a better roll. Hold on. Get into here. Here we go. Hello, you. Easy. Uh, yes, go. Twenty four. Got it. Boom. What do we got here? Go in. Is there a door right there? <gasps> There's a door right there. I took the long way around for nothing. What is in here? Is there anything in here worth? What's in his wooden chest? Oh, okay. Alright, fine. Here, stay around here. Um, I'll pick this door too. With ease. Let's not get caught off guard. There, go. Go, roll. 24. Twice. Two 20 doors in a row? Interesting. Another step forward. Okay, what is over here on this side? How do I get into here? Oh, 
God, that thing scared the shit out of me. Hold on, before I do all that, quick save, just in case. Some stupid bullshit. But yeah, lockpick, okay. There, and done. What is in here? There's a rat down here. What to do? These boots have seen everything. The lips, the tongue. If your mighty master. Sweet potato, half eaten apple. Orange. What's this rat? the victuals in this basement for the good of rat kind I'm not an oppressor that was any of this yours I'm also here to do that actually <laughs> do what you want I don't care I'm also here to do that actually then you're one of us you believe in the equal distribution of food regardless of species uh Sure, now let's grab what we can and get out of here. Oh yes, and you should definitely rise and overthrow those oppressors while you're at it. We shall. We will fly in the face of the oppressors and their foolish laws. Leave no crust unnibbled. No, oh, I thought he was going to run off and like attack everything. Apparently no. Hmm, what is that? Spicy pork sausage. Anything else in here? A worth? No. Nobody cares. Blah! Okay, what do we have? Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Yes, but they were shopping first. Dinner with my How about we settle Remember? on the Gondians and Sarma was such a bargain. We can't return. I sense some hesitation. Speak. Good sir. It's just some pressing to need something like this. Who are you? If you are in need of some pleasurable assistance, might I direct you to Sharessa's caress? I only deal with referrals. I'm, uh, I'm not doing anything. I mean, uh, good day to you. Let's just stick to the list. The Absolute Army slay siege. They won't care about stupid list. If you're here to shop, just buy what's needed. All right. Some people are panic buying. Let's not add to the problem. No, I'm here to talk to y'all. Why is everyone acting so normal? The absolute armies are coming. We need to stock up. Oh, I see. You're one of those. Okay, cool. Head over here. What's over here? What are all of these places? Is that a chest? Who is that? That's refugee. There's that. 
this big building here. What is this? Mark Ward. Anybody I click over here? Nothing. Wait. Slousy armor fur? What? Maybe. You have got to check out Dan Thelon's dancing axe. Their leather work is amazing. Uh, what? I'd love to chat, but I've got a suit to find. Who knew buying something so simple would take the bones of a day? Hmm. Sterling, very leather-like. Okay, well, let's go over here. Then I go in this building, search over there. Excuse me, we're discussing steel watcher gyronetics. A topic beyond your understanding, I imagine. What? My mate got thrown by a steel watcher. Lucky bugger. The trajectory was perfection. Let's go to Calm's Guns. Are you still watch a fan too? If so, we meet here every day to discuss their mechanics. What? Why would you? You told me the armor was a They are machines that are controlled by the absolute. Who the fuck are you? Sidle away from him slowly. What? What up? What do you want? Yay! You spoke to me. Nobody ever talks to me. My name's Narber, adventurer to be, soon to be the best adventurer anyone's ever seen. Oh God! As soon as I figure out what kind of adventure I want to be. Yeah. What do you think? This was fun. Can I got to get some shut eye though. Got to get up early. Yeah, I know. You got the 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 kid. The new, the new baby, the newborn. I'll check you later. Take it easy. Why don't you actually fight me and I'll tell you. Here's a tip to get you started. Less talking, more fighting. Follow your dream and find out. Maybe pick a different career. Hmm. I cannot give less of a shit. Oh! Uh, Alright then. Uh, sorry to bother you. Hey, let me talk to you again. Talk to me. Roar! 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 Are you scared? Did you wet your pants? Did you? Did you? Hmm. Let me guess. You decided to try being a barbarian. <laughs> Not even slightly. Uh, appreciate the honesty. Oh, oh well. Back to the narbing board. What the hell? Carmen Pennygood, what a penny good. Oh, stranger. Thanks for stopping by Calm's Gums. I'm Calm. Well, Carmen. <laughs> what can I do you for? Hmm, you're not quite got the pattern you nailed yet, Garvin. Ugh. If it's empty pattern you want, get your clothes from a brother, Figaro. But if it's genuine quality and genuine taste you're after, calms garms as you covered. Hmm, your brother is in danger. I found his name on a serial killer's list. A killer? That's... God's... I have no love from my brother, but that's extreme. He doesn't deserve that. Thanks for warning me, but it's him that needs warning, and he never listens to me. Hmm. So you don't get on with your brother? You wouldn't either, if you knew him like I did. Since Dad died, he thinks he's cock of the bloody walk, that I should give up my shop and work for family business. For him, dick. Hmm. So you lost your dad after all. You just lost your dad after all. Maybe you 
should keep your nose out of where it doesn't bloody belong. Now, you want clothes or not? Uh, let me take a look at it. Yours. Sounds good. Get you something a bit fresher than your current outfit. Current outfit? Fresher? What? Oh, wait. Ooh, this is all garbage. Can I try it all on? Examine. Oh, no, that's terrible. Terrible. Examine. Nope, that's terrible. Did I just click on the same one? Comfortable. It is. Okay. This one. Examine. Wait, they're all... They're all, you know, the thumbnails got different deal, but it's the same. Examine. No. Terrible design. Examine. What is this? Oh, it looks kind of like Shadow Hearts shit. Hmm. Hmm. No, I'm good. It looks like garbage anyways. Remember, calms, calms, here for all your fashion needs. No, I don't care. Since it letter, Yargo. Here's Carmen to work samples again. Here's right. And Mr. Seamlock or what are you? Which one was that? I just read. Was that the sense of letter? Uh letter from Figaro. Do take care not to tell your customers in return to face makers. I don't want them confusing your horrendous designs with my own. I hope this finds you blessed. Figaro. Hmm. Bastard. Soul tray, needle book, nope. Come on. This is all garbage. What's upstairs? Did you see our father watching through me? Must have been ten legs. Carms, carms, what is up here? Hmm, there is nothing up here. Unless we want to go one more layer up. I don't see a way to go up further. Fine. Go back down. Place is useless. You're not wearing armor to meet my mother and father. Which makes him the inventor. Glenda Old Tower. Need something? I've got the tools for any job. Any job. This is another hag. Maybe. Whatever you're working on, hope that fixes it for you. Hmm. Dancing axe sign. Uh, no. Yeah, let's go in here. So me. Welcome to Danthilon's dancing act. Don't draw any trouble on old Enthal. He acts like he's up for it, but he's retired for a reason. Hmm. What do you got? Greetings, sir. Your noble bearing brings a little class to my humble establishment. How may I be of service? Jahira sends me. I'm to meet some harpers here. Oh, okay. Harpers? I am afraid I serve a grubbier class of clientele than that. More chancers than champions, if you take my meaning. Present company excluded, I'm sure. No, I don't know any, uh, Jahira, was it? 
It was. She certainly knows who you are. And known to feed people truth herbs. Clothras. I know the taste all too well. You too, I'd wager. Fine, yes. You have the right place. But where's the leaf flicker herself? That's where. But she trusts me with this. She wouldn't have revealed this place otherwise, which makes you one of the rare breed she does trust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here's the key. The others are below. And bearing bad news by the looks of it. Okay. Before that, is there time to trade? Always. What's the key? What does he have? Ooh. Gauntlet of the Warmaster. Heightened maneuver. Targets have disadvantage on saving throws against your maneuvers and weapon actions. Oh, okay. That's great for a fighter. Cloak of displacements. At the beginning of the wearer's turn, the cloak activates, granting enemies disadvantage on attack rolls that target the wearer. Its effect lasts until the wearer takes damage. Oh, okay. Hold on. Oh. Um, Let's do this right here. What bow is this? Blightbringer. Makes gnomes or attacking gnomes or dwarves with this weapon receives a 1d4 bonus to attack and damage pulse. Prey decelerator. Oh god, I was reading that. Hold on. Lands a critical hit. Also slows the target creature. Ah. Okay. Harmonic Dueler. Ah, that's for a bard. He lights crossbow. Longbow. Pike. Quarterstaff. Rapier. Spear. Horns of the Berserker. Seeking blood. And gain plus two bonus to attack rolls when attacking creatures that have already taken damage. Bloodthirst. Unarmed and melee attacks will deal an extra two necrotic damage as long as you don't have your full health. If you don't deal any damage this turn, you take one d4 necrotic damage at the end of your turn. Holy shit, that's great for Carla. What she got for her headpiece? Hold on. Last stand during combat when she wears starts 50% hit point, she gains two wrath. What did wrath do? Possible bonus to damage with melee weapons for every turn this condition has remaining. Oh. Now this is better. I shall take this. Garb of the land and sky. Mmm, no. It's for a monk anyways. Mm. Yeah, it's for a monk. Hide armor plus two. No. Leather armor plus two. No. Plate armor plus one. No. Hail mail, split armor, studded leather, cloak of displacement. Oh yeah, that's what I'm gonna to get. Hold on. Snow dusted monastery gloves. Height maneuver. Oh yeah, it's for a fighter. Cloak of displacement. Cloak of protection. Wait, which cloak do I wear? Elemental absorption. Oh, okay. There is work to do. Cloak uh, well, displacement. Hello. Always in a foe. Heal yourself for 1d4 hit points. Uh, protection. Mm. You get 8 temporary, temporary hit points after casting a spell while in melee. Okay. Absorb elements. Hmm. 
I do like this cloak of displacement. Here. Magic items, consumables. Oh, that's ingredients, consumables. Uh, businessness, sea invisibility, oil bane, oil of accuracy, vigilance, combustion, splying. There, supreme elixir of arcane cultivation. I shall take that one too. There, and now I have three of them. And universal resistance. All right, cool. Short father, bless you. Right, Sommy, you're on the door till our friends are done. Gods forbid we do any business today. Turn. You break it, you... Well, knowing Enthal, it was already broken. Double doors, here we go. Okay, well, down we go. Dealing with the harbors. What is this? Harper Geraldus? You are not Jihira. Ah, you are very observant. I come in her stead, you reported me. You are very observant. I, I was hoping to greet the High Harper beneath Saluna's tears. You have the lad a little nervous. You're the one toppled Ketherick out in the Shadowlands, no? Geraldus isn't nervous. He's terrified. And he's using Saluna's tears as some kind of code. Throw the half -link's thoughts. Jesus Christ. Jesus, barely. Shit. Stare at me. Study me. This Harper's face bores me. Perhaps I'll steal yours next. Strike before the doppelganger do the doppelgangers do. Not enough movement. What? Here, let me rage, because I'm gonna rage. Hmm. God damn it. For God's blessing, do not realize. Save it. And attack again. Of course, in turn. Okay, bonus action, I need poison. Which poison do I need? Drow. Hmm. Here's a like shot. Who's next in turn? That one? Go.
Immune to drow poison. Of course they are. Yes, of course. Attack that one? Yeah. Ugh, here we go. Combat. God damn it. Okay. Enter. Yeah. It was, um... Okay, uh, meta magic, quicken spell. Oh, I've already used a bonus action. Never mind. Uh, don't do that. One, two, three. No, and no. No. Okay, fly. Yeah, let me get up there. My faith will protect me. Moving. Um. Let me get spirit guardians out. Fourth level. Yeah, fourth level. Where is it at? Spirit, spirit, spirit guardians? Crusader's mantle. Spirit guardians. Radiant. And then... Yeah? Right? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, enter. Carlag, you're up. You go over here. Smash the fuck out of this one. Okay, do it again. Reckless. Yeah, sure. Yeah, down. <gasps> you missed? How dare you, Carlag, miss. Miss like that. Oh, the chest is burning. Shit. This way. There. Hmm. Offhand. The damn thing went in the fucking corner over here. Bastard. There, go attack that bitch. Good, go. Push my luck again. Can I see it? No target sight, okay. Mm. 
There we go. Right there. Boom, boom, boom. No. No. And no. How many has she brought to Bell's side, I wonder? What's inside? Shopping for a How much further can I go? Dinner with my parents. How else was I supposed to see the optics? Time to pack it in. Okay, well, there's everybody's talking outside. I can't hear a damn thing. What the hell? What is what is this? Kill order read. Uh you won't have to wear those Harper smiles much longer. Or and has given the order. Kill the crone, but not before you tell her how her little soldiers died. Hmm. Preserve some hair or sinew if you can. The chosen will like to st string a harp of her own. Hmm. Okay. So... Wait, can I get all this? Open up. Garch Ray, Banishment, Phantasmal Killer. Can't be chess. Hmm. Spy packs, surveillance notes. Curse to put my hands on everything. Yes, yes. Get the heaviest chest. What do we got? Three smoke bombs. Okay, cool. Wait, hold on. I need to get over here. Check, because I forgot about this damn chest up here. Why are there so many chests in here? The chest. <laughs> the beautiful chest. Yep. Okay, cool. Now I'll go talk to him. No thanks, necessary. Are you? <laughs> Don't thank me yet. How do I know you're not a doppelganger too? What was all that saloon's tears nonsense? A harper coat, meant to be used for doppelgangers, imposters, things like them. You're, you're the one High Harper Jahira sent. Hmm. She didn't send me anywhere. We're allies, equals. Right. Uh, equal to the High Harper. Uh, you can give her my report, then. The others. They're all dead. Or scattered. Did you hear a sent word of the victory over Ketherick? Set us hunting after the cultists in the city. But they were the ones hunting us. Things were quiet. Until we started to ask about the Rashomar. The Rashomar? What the fuck's a Rashomar? Rashomar. A native of Rashomon, the far eastern land known for its wild inhabitants and the witches who rule them. Hmm, who is a Rashomar? What does Jahira want with them? I... The High Harper didn't tell you. Uh, perhaps it's not my place. Just... Tell her this. I can't continue the hunt. Whatever the cult has done with the Rashima, they do not want him found. Hmm. 
Makes me wonder if they're all about to attack me. I think they are. What? By the more than summons curlies went on down there. The Harpers turn out to be shapeshifter assassins. Of course. Of course they bloody did. Clear out then. I'm guessing I have some tidying to do before the steel watch squeals by. That's it. No more questions asked. I've had enough dealings with Harpers to know I don't want the answers. Go on now. Hmm. Leave. What is up top here? Okay, well, we can unlock this door. What does this door do? What's behind door number one? There, block thick. There, there, there. Guidance, guidance, guidance. Give me the rolls. Roll it. Roll mitzvah. There we go. 32. Jesus Christ. That door didn't stand a ghost of a chance. <laughs> What's in the backpack? It's empty. Smoking pipe? What's in the wooden chest? That's a lot. Uh, robbing these folks blind. What's in the alchemy pouch? Nothing. Odd. Very odd. Crystal. Yeah, take the smoking pipe too. Mm-hmm. Will you quit? What's up with these damn camera angles? Okay. No, it seems to be good for that. Let's see what this does. What I wouldn't give to be the Gondi if I invented the steel watch. Let's go to Gondi. Style and Horst. Someone who appreciates the finer things. Welcome, sir. I need a quick word. What did you have, sir? Stop. Inhale through the nose. Hold. Exhale slowly through the mouth. <sighs> now you've just sampled some of Baldur's Gate's finest incense. Delicious, no? What? Any top notes? What? I smell better. Incense? I thought someone was burning rothy shit. <laughs> you know, head trauma can severely affect one's sense of smell, among other things. You may find my selection somewhat misaligned with your particular preferences. Hmm. Quite the establishment you have here. I must say, I'm rather proud of it. 
The wood panelling cost a fortune, but it's so worth it for the lux atmosphere it provides. Mm. What do we get, Zach? Everything alchemical from potions to poisons. Just do make sure you read the label before quaffing. Mm -hmm. mm, there. Yep, I shall buy all of this. Is there a button to just buy all? I swear to god I clicked that, what the fuck? Can I like hold control and buy a whole stack? No, can I hold Alt and buy a whole stack? No. Wait, cancel. I have a shift. Can I hold shift? No. Apparently not. No. Mmm. Consumables. All of them? Yeah, those. Give me all those. All the graders, all the basics. What elixirs do you have? Psychic resistance, ooh, mind reading, accuracy, invisibility, vaulting, elixir, battle mages, power, fame, nair, arsonist, remedial. Done. Be sure. Potion catalog, display case, on a greater healing potion. Parchment. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so that's Gorm's charm there. I haven't even gotten into the city yet, but can I go over here? What happens if I go over here? Will I just attack everybody? That seem to be the den where we are at. Devilish Ox. Deal with the gnomes. Dribbles the clown. He's searching for his body parts. Hmm. Maybe. Hold on. Let me see. F five. Please, L's and fist guy. Three steel watchers. Shit. Here, where are you at? Okay. No, will y'all quit moving? Shit. Y'all are fucking retarded. Stand still. God damn it. I wonder what the next move is. Okay. What a charmer. Carlyle. Give up a kidney for a tour of the Steelwatch Foundry. Substance has been tried and Ugh, as if any of us would be so fortunate. No, Imagine seeing no. Will you? Oh, let's go to Carlyle's. 
Oh, it's like herding cats. Hold still. Stand in one damn spot. You go over here. There. There. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Now you, bro. A greater. Did you see how far that watcher threw me? Was that? How? Tried to climb up yes, one, you sorry, madman. It's very leather-like. How else was I supposed to feel about this? Dinner with my parents. There you go. Did that not get? That only got. Stereon. Give to me the Gondian who invented the steel watch. Actually, Gortash invented the steel watch. No, he merely offered patronage. The Gondians built the steel watch. It's perfect. Yes, but they were Gortash's idea. There, they're superior. How about we settle on the Gondians and Gortash invented them? It was. We got armor. It's hard to find. Just like you could wear it to meet dinner with your folks. Near what? Wearing armor to meet my mother and father. I'd give up a kidney for a tour of the Steel Watch foundry. Because if any of you are so fortunate, it's because we already outdid you. Imagine seeing a watch of power for the first time. My heart flutters. Okay. There is there. That's fine. I'm tired. I'm tired of just trying to deal with it because they're they're such a pain. There, we're back together. Quick save again. Sheesh. Run up to the gate. See what's going on. Um. Can I go to the city? Worms crossing. Hmm. I guess I'll find another way to get over there. Meantime, I want to talk to this lovely person right here. Sorry, chum, can't let you through. Worms Rock's closed for the day. Hmm, see this? I've been invited to the court ordination. What's special about today? Investigator Valeria needs me in the lower city. A serial killer's on the loose. Situation more like deception. I am Lord Gortash's new occultist. Let me pass, or your name goes in the books as Book of Vile Darkness. <laughs> oh, yes, that's... Sounds great. I'm doing that. I have the legitimate reasons to go in there, but I'm going to lie anyways. So this gives me five, four. So that's ten right there. One, two, three. That's ten. Plus another four. Four. That's eight. So that's eighteen. Eighteen. Plus at least a minimum one each. So twenty. Twenty to twenty-eight. All right. So... Minimum, I have to low. I can roll as 10. Or else I'll fail. Shit. Maybe? I made it. Okay. 32. Nice. Very nice. Don't know what he needs you for when he's got those bloody great steel watchers. But... Unprecedented times and all that. Head through. You want the last door on your right. <laughs> Lower the gates. Special permission. Ah, kick. Here we go. 
What's in here? Behind door number one. Halt! We do not know how you gained entry, but your trespass shall not be punished. Lord Gortash has been expecting you. The Watcher's presence fades, but another takes its place. Confident, dominant, commanding. My most esteemed guest, we meet at last. I am Lord Enver Gortash. You are the prison bearer, slayer of the dread General Kethrick Thorne. I welcome you to Baldur's Gate, my city. Hmm. Pleasure to meet you. We could talk face to face. Can we talk face to face? I'm going to find you and I'm going to kill you. I admire your audacity, but it'll be the death of you. Catherine had an army of corpses and a crumbling tower. I have a city and an army of steel. It will be better for us both to resolve our differences amicably. And I have the perfect venue for a face-to-face -face meeting. Allow me to formally invite you to my inauguration. Make your way to the ceremonial hall. Mm. Gortash is expecting you. We shouldn't have any more trouble Please from the guards. Please make your way to the audience chamber. Micro Modron. Force curtain. Hmm. Lord Gortash. Enter the audience hall. Get Gortash's nether stone. Neither. Hold on. What is this down here? Oh no, that's the deal with the gnomes. That's his deal. That's that. That's that. Nope. That is Missouri. He's expecting me, yes, but that does not mean I have to listen. If it isn't little Will's chums, I hope he hasn't been too much trouble. Heard about his father, the Dead Three's puppet. A travesty, really. He's upstairs in Worms Rock, ordaining Gortash as Archduke. A splendid shindig, I hear, perfect for crashing. Go on up, we'll talk after, and bring the pup along if you can. I'd hate for him to miss the fun. No. Can I not go there? Go there or go there. Hmm. Can I go over here? No, let's go to the lower city. You're entering a different region. Venture forth? No, hold on. Um, yeah, I just quick save from talking to her. Let me go back. See what this does. If this screws anything up, I could jump right back. <gasps> Are we going to the Underdark again? Oh, wait, no, it's just a loading screen. It's just a loading screen, I say. Just a simple loading screen.
Jesus Christ, is it gonna take forever to load? What the hell? Now let's go. Ah, thank you for the lift, my friend. Thank you very much indeed. Ta-ta! Must be what if he give me shapeshifters boom ring while shapeshifting or disguising self? You gain a 1d4 bonus to all checks. Slightly slimy node. Okay, except item. Type. No, uh, latest. Hook of displacement. What does he have? Whenever he does poison damage. Still breathing, despite everything. Uh, slightly slimy note. Thanks for getting me in. Oh, you won. Of shape shifting or disguising yourself, you gain a 1d4 bonus to all checks. Hmm. So many quests to do in here. Jesus. Murder target rover. Investigating murders. Gauntlet Devella. Murder target. Murder target. Suspicious toys. Wizard of Water. Speak to the bookseller. Lorokan. Alexander. Cazador's place. Figaro. Nesha. Alexander. What is this over here? Destroy the steel watch foundry. Find a steel watch foundry. Alright, cool. Jesus Christ. <sighs> that said then, I am going to do a hard save right here. Right here an actual hard save and I'm going to be ending it here chat so let me give me a second uh, save game new save alright thank you do not load off let it do its thing there uh, damn over and uh, let's uh, let's see if there's anybody we can read who we got Yeah, no, there's nobody to read right now. So with that said, thank you for coming out. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and follow, you know, so you know when I'll be streaming. Um, watch it on YouTube, lamb, like, subscribe, you know, comment something you liked about the video or not. It's up to you. No big deal. So, and uh, let me go ahead. I'll tab over and y'all take it easy out there. Be kind to each other. Good night.